Hey everybody, welcome back to Cooking in Pajamas. Today we're going to make uh, spaghetti with uh, my meat sauce. Now, I chopped everything already and everything's going to go straight in the pan. I'm going to heat it all up and bring it all up for you. I only have 15 minutes or else I got to stop you and do it again. So when we get to 10 minutes, I'm just going to stop it. So here's what we're going to be using. Sausage right from the casing. I already got it cut open. A nice pint of mushrooms. One medium sized onion. One pound of ground beef. Two uh, small green peppers. One zucchini. One can of tomatoes. One can of tomato sauce and some herbs and spices I'm going to throw in there. So here we go. Don't mind my arm here. I'm going to try to figure this darn thing out. That's not going to do any good. Oh, uh, good. Yeah, it's going to work for me, right? Oh, goodness. We're just going to put some, uh, Oh well, in there, just a couple rounds. Let that get nice and warm. And uh, yeah. Sausages is one pound. Sausages are one pound. And what I'm really going to do is I'm going to start to brown the sausage and brown the ground beef together, and then throw the onions and the peppers. In and let them sweat out as long as with the zucchini and the mushrooms. And after they start, they get a good, nice texture to them, nice look to them, browning. I'm gonna throw, uh, I'm gonna throw the tomatoes in, in the sauce. Should taste pretty good. I make it all the time for my husband. He loves it. I probably should throw some garlic in there, but I'm gonna cheat today and just put some garlic salt in there. My fingers already smell like onions. Okay. My little trick that I know I would have gotten yelled at if I would have done before. Nope. Nothing yet. See, this is when I should stop it because I know it's going to run over if I don't do it. But who wants to watch two minutes of an intro and then go click on another thing, huh? I got this on a medium heat. I'm just going to bring it up to a medium high just to get it started. So we can rock and roll here. Uh, onions are still making me cry a little soon here. The sniffles. All right. Look nice and hot. I'm going to throw our beef in there first. It looks nasty enough, but it's, it's all good. My hair getting in there. I should wear a hat, huh? Yeah. It's disgusting even for me. But it's clean. I just shower every day. One of them lucky moms who has a husband that says, Hey, go ahead and shower. I'm going to look at the kids my mommy time. I just take this right out of the casing. It doesn't take much. Just make it a little bit. You can use spicy if you like. This is mild. My husband and I can't eat spicy food. It doesn't number on his stomach. I'm going to turn it down a little bit. Now, I prefer Johnson meal, but this is another one that's going to cheaper and I just got spat in the eye with some oil there. So I'm just going to uh, pick one of these. That's something I got from Camper's Chef. It was free or came with something. And it just looks good enough to use to keep the uh, 
to ground up the sausage and the beef. It's always taking forever because it's stuck to the inside of the skin. How are any y'all? You're not real, you just cooked at home, you're not a chef or anything. It's really do ask what these casings are made for. If you're really curious, send me a little comment or a little message and I'll tell you what it is. But this sausage is from the ham, the, the, uh, the moines. It's not like hot dogs. So, we got to worry about that. Organic, but it was cheaper. So, I said, oh, what the heck. Let me try something different. Hell, it's cheap. Hey, Ooh. Ooh. The bottom's going to get done before the top. <laughs> you say, it's a lot of... That's going to be a lot of sauce. Yeah, it is. It is going to be a lot of sauce. I'll tell you what. Make a lot of sauce so you can freeze it. And you can make more later. Then you don't have to work so hard. Once you make the first batch, second or third batch, depending on how many kids you have and how old they are, you know them teens are eating it up like nothing else. I was a teen. I was an eater. That was bad. But... It's all right. It's all right. I'm just gonna mash this up. Walk around up like. We're doing a timer. It's seven minutes. All right. We're halfway there. I'll shut this thing off at ten and restart so you'll have two to go. Mix it up so you can't even tell the difference. And people go, holy cow, that tastes so good. What's in there? Just smile. It's like sausage and beef. Get my husband's beef fix on, get my sausage fix. Well, I'm not even going to say that. I know my friend Aaliyah. Alright, look at that. Cook a little bit. If you want to drain the grease, drain the grease. If you don't, don't. It doesn't matter. It's not going to hurt anything. It's not going to affect nothing. Everybody says, drain it, drain it, drain it. That's just health conscious. I got the, less, the least fat I could get. That grease also adds an enormous amount of flavor. So, I think I go with flavor. But like I eat this stuff every day, which probably will be a sandwich for me tomorrow. I like spaghetti sandwiches. I seriously prefer gas over electric. I guess it's not quite done yet, but I'm going to put these in here. Put these in here. Yeah, those are onions, peppers, and zucchini. I'm going to have to put a whole lot of mushrooms in.
couple of handfuls. I'll close the lid. And right here is where I'm going to stop us until that gets to where I like it. And then I'll turn this back on and you'll just restart. Alright, I'll see you in a few.